Hello everyone, I'm Pie Patch, and welcome back to Tiny Bunny. Oh, I forgot to hit record and I played a bit of it. It's... What can I say? I'm not, I'm not all there right now. <laughs> but let's just, let's just pretend that none of that happened and keep going. I'm gonna, t oh Jesus, don't like that. Turn on the TV please, that sounds lovely. God. I know those are glasses, but my eyes look so creepy. <laughs> the old photon TV was gathering dust in the corner. All that was left was clicking the button on the front panel. That's fun. Is that just how you entertain yourself? Clicking the TV on and off? The tube warmed up and familiar white noise started dancing across the black screen. I almost reached out to turn on the VCR when the noise calmed down and a blurry image appeared for a moment. It was a dark tap. Oh, I love this stuff, yes. Wait. Oh, cool. Oh, I love this kind of audio stuff. Okay, cool. If I get the time, I want to see if I can mess around with it and play backwards or something like that. Oh, I love these. I'm a big audio person, so this kind of stuff gets me so hyped. Yes, okay. Hey everyone, uh, this is future pie patch, time patch if you prefer. Um, <laughs> I had a bit of a go at uh, editing that audio. I didn't come up as clean as I was hoping for, but I guess these distorted audios never do. Uh, it sounds like a guy to me. Um, and if you can piece together any of what he's saying, please leave it in the comments below because I'm super curious. But I feel like I picked up on a few little phrases in there. Uh, the, them being, um, which is fine by me, can't keep my something, uh, and then lastly at the end, which I feel is super clear, um, and I came in and I found him and it feels like he, he's, he's walked in and, and found a guy dead, probably maybe this little kid that is lost, who knows. Um, but yes, if you have any ideas about what this says, and I'm going to play it in a second, please let me know. But I'm also going to keep uh, an eye out for these phrases popping up in the game, because it certainly feels like we've got a mystery on our hands. Okay, here's that audio. <laughs> Continuing. <laughs> it was a dark tiger forest, just like the one outside my window. Hmm. Coincidence. The picture split the screen in half. Something creepy resembling human speech was coming out of the speaker. Just a few moments later, the scenery was again overshadowed by noise. Did I catch some rogue signal? Local TV station only really showed Soviet cartoons, and even that was pretty rare. And the only, and only just recently I used to watch, uh, oh gosh. And only just recently I used to always watch Robotech before school. It was so awesome. Hell yeah, Transformers. Maybe I should tinker with the antenna. What if I catch this channel again? On the other hand, Ola, Olya had asked me to find the tape, and it wouldn't be nice to disappoint her. No, go watch Aladdin with your sister. But in my sleepy state, I didn't have the strength to do all of it. Watch the movie with your sister. She is sad, and she needs a buddy right now. Let's search. Fun, hippo friends. I sifted through the shelves of dolls and blue hippos from Kinder Surprise. Yes! Heck yeah, Kinder Surprise! I found the tape I needed thanks to its shabby spine. Well, okay, bye then. I got the black rag 
I got the black rectangle from its box. The tape inside it rustled while rewinding to the beginning. This rustle was lulling me to sleep. This is about where I got up to before, so from now on I got no idea what's gonna happen. Drowsiness attacked drowsiness attacked me while I was squatting before the TV. Images whirled in my head, me and Olya flying above the forest, tumbling in the soft clouds. My little sister is laughing, but her smile becomes more and more forced with every passing second. I notice that the clouds underneath us part, bearing the bristly pine tops. Swampy darkness slurped among the trees. The wings are no longer able to hold us and Olya. You haven't started without me, have you? My sister brought the tray with unevenly cut bread and a whole can of condensed milk. I rubbed my eyes. No, come, sit. Mum and Dad are arguing again. They're going through rough times. Oh, that's what I said. They're going through rough times. Rough times are lame. <laughs> Get it, sister. I know what I mean. <laughs> On the screen, Wendy was hiding- Oh, Peter Pan, that's what we're watching, yes. Wendy was hiding Peter Pan's shadow in- Was hiding Peter Pan's shadow into the dresser? Okay. Olya was entertained by the cartoonish dog, Nana. Maybe Mum and Dad will buy us a dog too. Whoa. Sorry. <laughs> I, I just saw that- <laughs> Look at- Oh my god, I love that alligator. Look at him. <laughs> oh, I'm too easily entertained. Yeah, right. I'll have my own dog in, Neverla in the Neverland, and a cat, and a parrot. Olya smeared a slice of bread with a thick layer of condensed milk and handed it to me. I've never heard of that, but that does kind of sound amazing. Have you lost all of your baby teeth? Obviously. Olya frowned, deep in thought. Peter Pan has baby teeth. What if they won't let you go to his land without adult teeth? Well, we'll think of something. We'll ask Dad to alter your age in the passport. Genius. I love it. And why would Dad forge documents? Because Netherland, you loser. What? Olya took a bite from the sandwich and started talking with her mouth full. <laughs> <laughs> is that the best I can do? Wait, let me, I'm gonna, let me take a drink of water. As soon as I put it in my mouth, I realized that wouldn't work. Wait, what if I put, nope, I'm not putting dice in my mouth. <laughs> that is the best I can do, I'm sorry. You'll grow ears as big as Dumbo's. Olya got worried and touched her ear. I smiled to myself. My little sister was silent now. She, she just devoured the bread, watching the adventures of Peter Pan, Tinkerbell, and James Hook. Who calls him James Hook? As if she got sucked into the fairy tale Neverland. To be honest, I also imagined myself there, in a land where one never ages, where no one argues over little things, where no one listens to fights and the sound of broken plates at night. It felt like I was dreaming with my eyes still open. Then my sister's scream pulled me back to reality. Oh, yikes. Tony, shut the curtains fast! Wh why? No one's watching you. It's dark, and when it's dark, the owl comes. I'm, I'm scared. I got out of bed, fighting my drowsiness, and closed the curtains. Yeah, let's close the curtains. Heck yeah, we don't want owls getting in. Jesus. I did my best not to look outside, toward the treetops, toward the tiger forest, which seemingly drew closer and closer. Of course, it was just a visual effect from shadows of branches scraping the snow. Well, Tony, Mum thinks I made the owl up. And Dad, too, thinks I'm a liar since I'm small. But the owl exists. Honestly, honestly it does. You do believe me, right?
and it comes every night. And, and I swiftly grabbed Olya's hand and looked her in the eyes. I was trying to transfer at least some of my courage and determination, but did I really have those qualities? Yes, I believe you, all right? Just don't nag our parents about it anymore. They're already dealing with a lot, so they'll just get mad at you. Come and tell me if anything happens, and don't look out the window. But it wants me to look. Doesn't matter. Act like it doesn't exist and never existed. Like it's made up, just like mom and dad say. It'll get tired of waiting and fly away. It was madness, but after everything that's happened recently, I was more and more inclined to believe all Yazal existed. We followed Peter Pan's adventures as if nothing had happened, as if the forest didn't kidnap kids, as if our parents weren't tearing each other apart bit by bit. Captain Hook was running away from a crocodile, and Captain... wait... Is he... is he a captain? Okay... I'll just... okay then. And Captain Pan was headed to London on a gilded sail... Did that happen? Did I miss that bit? How long... I haven't watched Peter Pan in a while. Does he become a captain? <sighs> By some miracle, I lasted longer than my sister. Olia's eyelids had dropped. She started snorting lightly. S snorting? <laughs> I'm sorry. I, this, the translation is actually fantastic. But it just catches me off guard. I love it. I love it. It's great. Resting her chin on the side of the bed, I stood up and left Olya's room. Oh no, please don't let her get hurt. I was looking out the window, studying the field, when Mom peeked into my room. Enough playing around. It's your first day at school tomorrow. Go to bed, you should sleep properly. You don't want to be teased for being sleepy, right? For being sleepy? Jesus! Adults think everything is so simple, as if we, as if sound sleep would ensure my classmates would like me. Yeah, bud. I covered myself with a blanket up to my neck and listened to the house humming, to something invisible rustling in the corners. My inner voice had a question for me. Do I want to hear that mysterious flute again? Yes or no? Oh, I thought I was going to get to choose. <laughs> like, I don't want that decision. Maybe it's just a part of growing up and I can't fully understand my own desires. The forest wailed behind the barrier that was my walls. Some ethereal entity wandered the fields. Branches shook as if calling for me. The wind howled on and on in the night. D I don't like the squeaky door. My thoughts were like annoying flies that entered my head before becoming weak and tangled. I didn't notice how I fell into slumber. And then it was morning and everything was fine. Oh, oh my god, that was that was episode one. Thank you for putting it. Did you enjoy it? Do you want to know what happens next? We're probably working hard on... Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, yes, I want to know what happens. Oh my god, I don't like how it shakes. Okay, awesome. This is so good. Oh my gosh. I love this game so much. The art style is incredible and the music is great. I want to see if I can find the soundtrack for it because some of the songs was just 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 so nice um yeah i am definitely definitely going to be playing episode two i'll have a look and see if it's out yet because i don't know if it is so it looks like this is actually just the uh early access like first chapter of it which means it's free so if you guys want to play this game i highly recommend it uh like this was so good and beautiful. I would not be not have been upset at all if they charged man money for it. But um, I'm afraid I don't actually know when the rest of it is coming out. There's a page for it up on the Steam store, but um, it's not up yet and doesn't have an estimated date. I can't I can't wait for it, and I for sure will be playing it when it comes out. But uh, yeah, they do have the soundtrack up there though for like three dollars, which is awesome. I'm definitely going to get it. 
Um, awesome. But thank you very much for joining me and I'll see you all in the next video. Goodbye. I hope you have a wonderful day.